strongest position for the disciple of Jesus Christ, for the disciple of Christ, is when you are at your absolute weakest. Because it's when we are at our weakest that we turn to God that we don't rely on ourselves. And if you read your Bible, if you look in Scripture, that is exactly what God does. He looks for the weakest. He looks for those that have no confidence in themselves, those who don't rely on their own abilities. We, we're, we're rushing around. We're, we're caught up in this rat race called Sydney, and we're just trying to make everything good. We want to make sure our bank balances are healthy. We want to make sure that we're up there with work and that we've got everything going on. But can I tell you, that's, God doesn't, he's not impressed with any of that. He's not impressed by our strengths. But let me tell you, he's drawn by our weaknesses. Here is the divine law of attraction. He's drawn by your needs. He's drawn by your sicknesses and your weaknesses. Praise God. That's how God works. We, we think we got to present God with our best. No, we just present God with what's there. With an honesty and a transparency. He doesn't look for your strength. He doesn't rely on our abilities. But it's when we are weak. Amen. This is the divine law of attraction. He looks for what we don't have. He looks for those that are in need. And it's only when we are in need, amen, that we call upon God. That God, I can't make it without you. I can't do this without you in my life. Amen. And if you are sitting here today and you are in that position where you have a need and you're full of faults and failures and, and you've got weaknesses and you've got shortcomings, let me tell you, you are the number one candidate for Jesus Christ to intervene in your life because he's drawn by your needs. Amen. Hallelujah. That's why none of us here, none of us came to God and when we were at our zenith in our lives, when everything was going great, when our life was fulfilled, most of us, if I could dare say all of us, have come to God because there was some crisis in our lives, because we had a need in us that we knew that no man could meet those needs, and so we turned to God. We looked to Him, and He came through for us because when we were in need, and I'm simply saying to you today, we can't ever lose that. I don't care how successful you get in your business or in your job or in your ministry. We can't ever lose our reliance and complete dependence on God. Amen. I pray every time before I get up in this pulpit, Lord, I don't. doesn't matter how, many, how long I've been preaching. I still need you. I can't speak without you. It's just me. It's just my head knowledge if it's me. But you've got to speak through me. It's through your anointing for his word said it's not by might it's not by power but it's by my spirit saith the lord 